Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to create a new workbook using Excel VBA macro. So if you want to create a new workbook, just open a blank workbook and go to the developer tab and inside the developer tab, you will find an option visual basic. Click on that visual basic and insert a new module. New module will be inserted. Now we are going to create a subroutine to create a new workbook. So I'm just typing sub followed by the subroutine name as new underscore workbook. So now I'm going to define an object for my new workbook using set command. New WKB and I'm going to add workbooks dot add method. So now I created an object for my new workbook. Then we have to using a with and end with statement. We have to define the specification of this new workbook. So new underscore WKB. I want this new workbook title. The title should be say my title and I want the subject of the new workbook as my subject. And I want the new workbook to be saved somewhere. So I should use a method save as followed by I have to give file name as well. So here uh, I want the workbook to be saved with a file name WKB1 followed by the extension. WKB here you can give an any extension any supported Excel supported ex extension for example if you want uh, the new workbook to be saved in a um, compatibility mode you can give dot XLS or if you want to be saved in the uh, recent version then you can give w dot XLSX or if you want to save this workbook in a comma separated value which means a CSV then you can give that as CSV here so whatever extension you want you should give it here and finally you need to use a method close to close this new workbook and click on end with statement just close this uh, with a statement with end with statement that's it now we are all, all set to create a new workbook and one more thing you should note is here we have mentioned just a file name so if it didn't specify any path then it create a new workbook in your default my documents folder but i want the new workbook to be created in the same path where this macro exists that is this macro workbook is saved actually this macro workbook is saved in this directory so instead of copy paste this directory you can either copy paste this directory or you can also use an option called this workbook dot path followed by and give backslash and combine it using an Amazon operator and just give a space that's it so now if we execute that it will create a new workbook called wkb1.csv in this path so let's see how it works that's it so this macro is run we will navigate to the path and see what happened yes it created a file name wkb1.csv as we mentioned let's open and then see the properties here it's showing the property of the csv file title is my title that is what uh, we gave here my title subject is my subject and author it by default it picking up my pc name so this is how you should how to create a new workbook using excel vb macro thank you for watching this video please subscribe